Time for the Kate Quickcast, checking mm -hmm. stories, making news as you head out the door. It's a day some Wichitans have been waiting months to see. Costco is opening a store on Wichita's east side with a ribbon cutting this afternoon. Now, many Wichitans, myself included, mm -hmm. have been waiting for the arrival of Costco. It's located at Kellogg and Webb, and in just a matter of hours, members will be able to hop inside for a preview of the warehouse. Never club. been to a Costco, so you're going to show me around. <sighs> Never we'll been go. to one. It's I know. Thing. Also, making news this Tuesday a robbery in a South Wichita home leaves a person with injuries. Officers say it happened about 12 30 this morning on South Washington near South Mosley. Police tell us the man was hit with a handgun when two robbers just walked in the front door of an unlocked home. Today should be the final day of service for the current Wichita Airport Terminal. Staff members will move items to the new terminal tonight beginning around sunset. And Wichita City Council will receive a new report today on the state of downtown. The Downtown Development Corporation reports the area had 263 new residential units open last year. An interim official of the Transportation Security Administration is being reassigned. A test by the TSA's Inspector General found people were able to take banned items through airport checkpoints more than 90% of the time. Starting wages will go up for more than 100,000 Walmart department managers. People in specialty areas such as the deli also will have higher starting pay. The Oklahoma Highway Patrol has released a video showing two brothers approaching them last weekend during what was supposed to be a flood rescue. Nehemiah Fisher reportedly grabbed one trooper and knocked him down. Mm. Then Fisher was shot and killed. 